Well, we uh, would like to uh, do some work on the roof and the bell tower. Uh, we have a uh, uh, large bell in the bell tower that actually uh, was donated by the firefighters in Acton. Uh, it needs some work, the roof needs work, uh, the uh, exterior brick of the building uh, needs restoration work as well and of course we're uh, subject to the uh, requirements of the Heritage uh, 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 Ontario and uh, have to uh, comply with uh, the type of restoration that is needed. What is the Acton Town Hall currently being used for and what do you hope it will uh, extend its services for in the future? Well, we currently have, uh, last year, for example, we had over 260 events uh, and uh, uh, that took place in the hall. Uh, they covered a, an extremely broad range of community activity from rotary meetings to hosting the uh, candidates debates during the last municipal election. Uh, we uh, have uh, exercise groups, uh, Zumba classes, uh, artisans, uh, markets, uh, uh, Christmas auctions. We have a speaker series that we host there for various uh, people to come in and talk about things. So it, it is, as I said, a, uh, become a cultural and uh, hub for the community. Uh, the BIA will be moving into the, the uh, facility uh, in April as well. And uh, we've been working closely with them and the municipality because, uh, uh, as you know, uh, these sorts of uh, facilities uh, are important for community growth and development. Uh, the uh, uh, recent expansion of GO train service uh, through to Kitchener has made a big difference in terms of, uh, you know, the focus uh, from those people wanting to move into the community to look at Acton as a possible place. And uh, with the uh, opportunities that we provide the community in the terms of arts and culture. That's an important consideration for them.